new this noon. A man convicted in a deadly hit and run case will not spend any time in prison. David Orr was charged with failure to stop and render aid and temper tampering with physical evidence. WLKY's Tim Elliott was in court this morning as the judge handed down the punishment. He joins us now from the newsroom with the details. Tim. Well, Karen, David Orr received seven years in prison this morning for striking and killing a bicyclist more than two years ago. However, that sentence was probated, meaning that Orr will be on supervised release for the next five years. If he slips up and violates that probation, he could be thrown in prison. Orr hung his head and gave no visible expression as the judge read that sentence today. Court records say in October of 2012, or hit 38 year old Travis Christie with his truck. Christie was riding his bike to work on Grade Lane when he was struck. He was found lying in a ditch on the side of the road. Orr was later arrested and charged the next month. Some of the victim's family members were in court this morning and told Orr how he changed their lives forever. I want you to know that the man you left for dead in a cold ditch that morning was 100 times the man you will ever be. If the roles were reversed, my brother would never have left you alone to die. Now, David Orr will spend the next 120 days in home incarceration. He will also be enrolled in the work release program. But once again, if he violates the terms of that probation, he could spend the next seven years in jail. Also, in the courtroom this morning, the victim's family went on to say that in this case, the justice system failed. Reporting live in the newsroom, Tim Elliott, WLKY News.